Hi guys, are you ready to draw with me today? Today we are going to draw a realistic bell pepper. So let's get started. It's going to be yellow and orange. Um, you can also use red or green if you like. So I'm going to use color pencils to color this. Uh, so if you want good quality color pencils, check the description box below for links. And I'm going to start with the stem of the bell pepper and then I'll show you how to draw the whole thing. And then I'm going to show you step by step how I colored it as well. So can't wait to share this all with you. And if you're liking this video and want to see more videos like this, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day because I release a video for you every single day and if you want to send me your drawing to get featured in my next video send it to my Facebook or my Instagram account all the information is in the description box below there are so much information you can check in the description box below um, so you can check it out and I can't wait to see your drawings as well uh, so I can share it with everyone as well as on my Facebook and on my Instagram account as well. So as you see drawing it is very very easy these drawings will only take you about five minutes to draw the whole thing it's all about shading colors and using the right colors uh, to get that look so I hope you like this bell pepper let me know if you like eating bell pepper as well in the comments below and let me know if you're finding it easy to draw with me and if you want me to do anything differently let me know in the comments below I will definitely do the changes that you want me to do if you are finding something is hard to see or something must be more clear let me know uh, so I can make it better for you and if you have any requests for me to draw as well please don't forget forget to comment below and uh, let me know so I can draw what you like and what you want me to draw and what you like to draw with me as well so all you need to do is comment below and if you're liking this video don't forget to hit that like button uh, for me as well so we're almost done with the drawing part but we're going to add a little more detail to it and then we'll start uh, coloring and I'll color the stem green and the rest is yellow and orange like I said before so stay tuned for that and if you like coloring more and if you have kids uh, I have a coloring book out on Amazon and the link is in the description box below it's only five dollars Canadian um, so it's even cheaper if you're in uh, United States um, so check it out and most of the animal drawings that I did for uh, kids is in there so you can watch the videos while you color as well or color it on your own and if you send me your drawing after coloring I will feature it in my next videos uh, that are coming up as well so up to you check it out in the description box below and um, if you want any of the drawings uh, kids drawings uh, as a PDF copy just one let me know I will send it for you for free and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day So you see that I started off uh, the coloring uh, with the stem area so you will see that I'm using different colors of green and I'm not uh, coloring the whole thing with that same color and I'm going to leave a little bit of white as well so it looks like it's shining and uh, you will see that as well and I'm going to use lighter green and a little bit of black for this area so uh, you can see in a bit how it looks and then I might go over the whole thing again later on as well and I will show you how it all looks at the end so if you um, think you missed something or uh, you want to see more details you will always see it um, when you see the final colored look as well if you want to use that as your color guide just a still picture of the full color drawing it's at the end if you want to watch the whole thing 
uh, learn how to how I colored it and uh, check the end picture for uh, more details and more shading ideas so now I'm going to color the whole bell pepper lightly with this um, really lightly with this uh, yellow color and then I'm going to uh, go over it the same uh, areas with a um, darker color as well an orange a little bit of brown and red as well so you will see all that and the shadow as well I will show you how it all comes together so while you're coloring I hope you're enjoying the coloring as well and I hope you like bell pepper um, if you do like bell pepper, let me know in the comments below. I love bell pepper as well and they are very very healthy. Um, they are packed with vitamins and low in cholesterol as well so it's really nice and they come in different colors so when you cook with it and use it in your dishes it gives like a really nice color punch to the whole dish as well so um, those are some of the reasons why i like bell pepper so you can let me know by commenting below um, they also contains a great deal of fiber uh, and iron as well So here's a fun fact about bell peppers, because they have seeds and come from a flowering plant, they are actually considered as a fruit, not a vegetable. Um, some people call tomatoes fruits as well, um, so I guess that has seeds too, so it can be a fruit as well, I'm not sure. So even though bell pepper looks like a chili, it does not have that chemical uh, that gives that strong burning sensation. So uh, when it comes to contact with your tongue, so that's a good thing. And they are sometimes, you can eat them just by itself as well. Uh, they can have this uh, sweet taste as well, some of them. Uh, especially those small bell peppers I love eating them just by itself as well because they are sweet and makes a great snack um, so um, they are called sweet peppers as well this is a fun fact that I didn't know before um, it says bell peppers have many different names in the US India Canada and Malaysia they're called bell peppers but in Australia and New Zealand they're called capsicum I didn't know that and the British simply call them pepper while the Japanese call them paprika Wow, that's very interesting to me. So what do you guys call it? Let me know in the comments below. I would love to know and I would love to know where you're from as well. So now we are at the final stages of coloring. Um, I'm going to add a lot more color to it so you can see how I'm adding color so you can follow the same color pattern and make sure you color it so that it looks fully colored just like this. This is the final colored look of the bell pepper. It, uh, like I said it's yellow and orange uh, so you can use the same color pattern and use this as your um, template to use the colors in the areas that you want to use colors and if you want products made out of this bell pepper you can see my red bubble link in the description box below and check it out uh, to see how it looks on products and now I have a next videos for you to check out as well I'll put some good ones for you uh, and the i button up top as well if you want more videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel by clicking on that face logo so I will see you tomorrow bye